John, Aston Villa back in the Premier League. Just sum up your emotions right now. Overwhelmed, to be honest. Uh, what a tough 90 minutes it was. We were in the driving seat and then that would be a good team. They're always going to have a spell in the game. Uh, maybe they had more of a spell than what we wanted, but we managed to get the job done and it's just an incredible feeling. What did it feel like to get on the score sheet? <laughs> I, was, I was delighted. I think you dream when you, you play football from whatever age you, you want to score at Hamden and, and Wembley. And, uh, I've not managed to score at Hamden, but uh, I've managed to score a winner in a playoff final at Wembley. And it's not really sunk in, sunk in yet, to be honest. Um, looking forward to enjoying my family up there in the box. So, um, hope we're all going to have a good night and, and hopefully we can thrive in the Premier League. What was your thoughts as the ball was coming over? It looked like an easy catch for the keeper. Uh, no, nah, I just knew it was mine. Uh, I wanted that a bit more than the goalkeeper. I knew that if I could go up there, uh, I would get it. It was just a question of whether the ref was going to be brave enough to uh, to, to award the goal and a lot of refs this season would have given that as a free kick so full credit to the referee for, for awarding it and uh, over the moon to get the winner. When we did that first interview all the way back in August did you always believe that this was possible? Yeah I think um, when you come to a club besides the this you've got to be competing in cup finals and, and try to be successful. We didn't have a great start to the season but uh, full credit to us for turning that around and uh, if you had the choice you would do it via the playoff final we managed to do that today. Yeah, like you said, is it the best way to go up? Hey, absolutely. It's not good for the heart, but uh, we've done it and everyone's over the moon and relieved at the same time. Cheers, John. Enjoy your night.